One of the many basic things Ghanaians struggle to deal with on a daily basis is the maintenance of traffic lights across the major national capitals. One would have thought that, with Accra being the capital with more cars and people, authorities would be much more serious with traffic light management and maintenance, but that is not the case. With the festive season approaching and the vehicular traffic already building up, a gridlock is almost inevitable if the traffic lights are not fixed to function. At the more than three traffic light intersections City News visited, there were different problems with the traffic lights. While some were totally off, others hanged off their stands, with others totally damaged and lying down. These were the scenes at the Ridge intersection, the Salam Down intersection heading towards the Kanda Highway and the Kwame Nkrumah interchange, causing a gridlock. This made it difficult for drivers and other road users to see and obey the instructions that come with a functioning traffic light. And there were also no police officers to help control traffic, giving some motorists a free day to misconduct themselves. It's very, very bad. Very, very bad. You see, this very one, it has so many ways, okay? People have been coming, some have been going this way, some have been going this direction. And it, it needs to be fixed, not this one alone. There is one just here. Very, very bad. Okay, the condition here is, you can see for yourself that the condition here is very, very pathetic. It causes accidents, it's waste of time and everything, Charlie, it wastes everything. When we are heading towards the Xmas uh, 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 festive season like this, when and the traffic breaks down like this, you see, it causes so many uh, um, tension in town, so they need to fix it. How many policemen they, 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 they want the president to employ? How many policemen? Traffic light be as in there was a policeman about at least five. Traffic light in a call of more than one month. Obiama. How? Christmas season, but yes, sorry, I see development country. Is it Ghana? Ghana is a development country. Ghana is a development country. Oh Jesus. The traffic cannot stop today because people are not understanding orders. So the traffic is still <laughs> Commercial drivers who had to stay in traffic much longer than they usually would had every right to complain. They say it worries us when there is a, a, a no traffic light is working. So you see this one will be going, this one will be going. We find it difficult to drive. In fact, it's very, very, very important. So if government can take care of these things, I hope it can help with the drivers. When you go to La Palm, when you go to everywhere, the traffic light go off. Some place, La Pala, this is treatment. So a treatment. If you go to Power Junction, the traffic light is off. If you go to Kanda Highway, the same thing. It affects our, our business because this one is going, this one, we don't have patience for, you know, to allow somebody to go before somebody to go. So if it happens, so we keep lowering the traffic. So which means it burn our, our fuel a lot. Because taxi driver don't want to keep long in the traffic. I was say one more traffic light in the bay. You they are higher than ten times. One will be until no one is so back on nature. One police in Ibian soon Jenaha and a man about no. The situation was intense at the asylum down traffic light intersection, forcing this commercial driver to abandon his car and help direct the traffic. I'm also a commercial driver running my movie to Tama Station. So I'm from Accra, whereas I'm all, almost two hours from the Accra high to this place. So I just alight and take my car gift to my mate. This is my car. Yeah, I just take the car gift to my mate and go and drop people at the Nima there. So, yeah, so that the road will be free so that we all to get free way to go. I know this job is to the police, but I'm also helping the nation. Yeah, because accident can happen right now without any police. That's why I said I'm supposed to help the nation. But he could only do this for a few minutes. Soon he was gone and the gridlock returned. This is a typical picture of many intersections in the capital where the traffic lights are broken down for months now and have not been fixed. To top it all, there's no police officer stationed at these various intersections to bring order. So drivers are trying to maneuver their ways through the traffic and are not being disciplined on the road because there's no one to direct them. They're also worried that if this situation is not fixed, as the 
festive season climax and will get worse. Reporting for City News, my name is Anshelly Zibu.